The gathering of eight de Havilland chipmunks at Classic Fighters this year highlights the continued popularity of these aircraft, which were first designed in 1946. ZK ARL was one of the original Canadian built examples and was imported in 1949. When the New Zealand Warbirds Association was formed in 1978, the aircraft became the first New Zealand Warbird even before the association acquired several ex Air Force Harvards. A more recent arrival in New Zealand is Chipmunk N861WP which was bought by the old stick and rudder company in 2003. This aircraft was used by His Royal Highness the Prince Philip when he was learning to fly in 1952 and it has recently been restored to its original Queen's Flight colour scheme. During the 1970s, Prince Charles and Prince Andrew also learned to fly in chipmunks. The chipmunk was designed as a trainer to replace the aging tiger moths, and we've seen many chippy fly paths at other shows. This year, Ralph Sachs demonstrated to the early morning crowd that the aircraft is also a very capable aerobatic performer. While the chipmunk can roll and loop, it can't fly upside down for any length of time. The 145 horsepower gypsy engine used in the aircraft doesn't have an inverted fuel and oil system. So, when the aircraft flies upside down, the carburetor float rises to the top and the engine momentarily stops. The last two chipmunks in military service are currently used by the RAF's Battle of Britain Memorial Flight. The two aircraft are not displayed, but are used to keep the Memorial Flight Pilots current on tailwheel aircraft, which is a design now absent from the modern RAF fleet. <laughs> 